what the fuck was that? Confused, but I'm so confused. What the fuck in the world was that? What happened? What? What happened? You fucking try to run Genshin. Does that seem to have caused it? Also, Genshin seems to be weird and different now. I don't know what's going on there. Never seen that happen on my fucking computer before. And coincidentally, it was with OBS, not the fucking game, but it closed my game too. Like it was my game. It must be that I'm just not used to that. Okay. I'm sorry. Yeah, so it wasn't just me. Something I'm just not used to it. All right. Um. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. OBS just kind of said, hmm, it seems that you're playing a game, and it seems that I also don't want to run. And uh, I did try restarting the stream multiple times just now, by the way, like uh, roughly three, um, before closing it and then restarting it again. It seems that OBS just was kind of like, hmm, this isn't okay. What the fuck are you doing? All right, like, for no specific reason, and I'm slightly, slightly confused about it. Um, If it was just OBS, I would be like, oh, well, um, Okay, cool, but my fucking game closed too as well. The one that was being captured, so I thought it was the game itself, which has never happened before. So, new issue on a fixed, brand new, fi brandly new fixed computer. Right? The brand new fixed computer. You are not welcome. I was looking at the graphics, I felt like these were lacking, but you know, to be totally honest, it might just be in my mind, so I haven't played in this bunch of long time. By the way, I would like to point out that we crashed the moment I did my riding shield on today. Pretty much basically saying that my riding shield is so fucking strong, right? That she can even transcend the limitations of my computer in her fictional little world. Right? She literally bursted my fucking computer. Hello, Nova. Pleasure to see you again. Yeah, but you know, it's, it's OBS. OBS has like its little group of issues that everyone experiences. That's why I ain't tripping about it. Ah, yes. What a lovely way back into the fucking game. What the fuck? These suck. <laughs> that was, those are garbage. What the fuck? <laughs> so trash. What the fuck are those artifacts? They're both double defense energy recharge. What has fucking HP main stat? Garbage. Now you're my what the fuck? Those are fucking garbage ass artifacts. Dog, stop trying to fight the other dog. Also, get your ass out of her face. She's not gonna fight you. I'm gonna bite you. Yeah, that's garbage, too. Alright, we're changing teams. This team isn't lucky enough. 
Oh, yeah. Did anyone see that XQC fucking signed a deal with Kick for like a hundred fucking million dollars? This man, this man literally just became a fucking millionaire uh, by being stupid on the internet and having a speech impediment. It's fucking wild, bro. Like, first off, I'm glad that he fucking got a deal like that because it's not, it's hard to get a deal like that. And after all the shit he probably goes through on stream where he has to literally exist in front of these fuckhead ass people. Dude, I completely fucking agree, all right? I view, like, streaming like I view teaching, sadly, all right? And yes, there are a lot of parallels, okay, between teaching and streaming in our current state of the world, all right? For streaming, you tell people information or make them watch content that they don't want to fucking watch or that they do want to fucking watch. Depends, right? Depends on the game. Sometimes people just go there for the teacher himself, right? For the sake of just being there, like the mods, right? And for teaching, it's the same fucking thing, where someone wants to be there, someone doesn't want to be there. Depends on the fucking content. Depends on the person. Right? Then, you gotta remember that teachers don't get paid well. They get paid shit fuck whatever. All right? And so does the goddamn streamer. They also get paid shit fuck whatever. They get paid like literally fucking nothing. Which is why I'm so confused as to how the fuck they're managing now. All right? And that's, and that's just like a few of the examples. Then you have like another example of the fact that everyone in the fucking stream could potentially be an absolute fucking dunderhead and have no idea what's going on half the time, which is pretty damn hilarious when you really think about it, right? And that's exactly what goes on in class, where I'm pretty sure the majority of the people there have no idea what the fuck is going on. And they're kind of just like, hmm, I fuck it, we ball. So, you know, I, I, I could be wrong, I guess. We're dying! We're dying! We're frozen! We're dying! <laughs> oh, yeah, Kazi is dying due to fucking burn damage and shit. Oh, shit! I think that could have killed us. Like, literally, that alone would have killed us. But, yeah. Thank you. But, yeah, I, dude. Uh, <laughs> I like how the I like how the current state of the world is. Oh yeah, you spent like literal multiple decades trying to get a PhD and teach at a high end uh, job, all right, or a high end school. Well, there's this funny little dude we call XQC who made a hundred million dollars by sitting on his computer and talking shit. How do you feel? You get me? It's like, dude, fucking hilarious. It's like the same argument that people be making. Ooh, shit, that's actually pretty good. It's like the same argument that people be making for fucking OnlyFans models where they complain that they do so much because woe is me and they're just sitting there shaking their ass making like a hundred fucking K a month by revealing their butthole or some shit. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. Though granted, I will say I haven't seen much hate on the event. I've just seen stuff about the event, which is nice. Yeah, you know I mean, it's always nice to see people not try to murder each other. Love that shit. Now, usually some people try to murder each other after like, hmm, I'm good. Boom. Oh shit, the burn. Right. Oh, I'm getting sick of this game. Yeah, it's fucking wild. Current state of our world is literally, hmm, okay, it seems you're funny enough. Like, basically, look, the way that streaming works is if you're likable enough, you'll be making, like, millions of dollars. If you're not likable enough, you're not making millions of dollars. That's the state of the world. If you're able to become a meme, you're making millions of dollars. If you're not able to become a meme, meaning you're just not inherently funny, you're not become, you're not making millions of dollars. Like, that's the current state of our world, and I kind of like it. I kind of enjoy that. Oh, dog. quite wild. All right, I'll take it. That's EM on EM piece with energy recharge. That's a good piece right there. It's actually pretty good. Oh, so I'm not going to be streaming for a long time. This is how it's going to be for like the majority of days. I still have work tomorrow. Uh, tonight. So I have work all week. So once again, I'm not even going to be streaming for a long time all week. Usually I have one day off and like Wednesday, I kind of have a day off, right? From which since the next day, guess what? It's not the case. You are not, not this here.
Uh, fuck off of me. Where's the other one? One of them's gone. Why is she over there? What the fuck is she doing? She's trying to grief me. She's zoning. I'm getting sick of this shit too. Goop the fuck up so I can kill you faster. No, no, no. That's, that's not what I meant. Yo, fuck off. Why is there Electro Swirl? Who the fuck is swirling Electro right now? I like how Dea is actually contributing damage. Because every time she causes a virgin, it actually does do a lot of fucking damage. And the burning is consistently nice. It's no it's no big vibe hours on God. Plus, I just wanted to see. Oh yeah, but let me tell you um what they said about my computer. So first things first, okay? They told me that there is nothing I could have done to prevent the computer from basically burning. Alright? The issue is not the display went out. The issue is that the motherboard got fried, the battery got damaged, and the fucking display, well, they just replaced it because it had a little scratch on it. All right? So, yeah, um, I asked them, how, what can I do to prevent this from happening as it was related to a heating issue subsequently, right? They just said, yeah, no, there's nothing you could have done. I was like, okay, so about my warranty then, because <laughs> now I have to ask. Because, you know, if my shit's not gonna fucking work because of well a fuck you basically what can i do to prevent it or do i have more ability to fix it they said i have like two more chances to so now i have to look into like another fucking computer probably like very very soon or i'll just be facing the idea of my computer being like hmm i don't want to work this week so you're not streaming you get me oh shit my kazua holy fuck <laughs> all right we don't talk about that 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 didn't happen God damn, what the fuck happened to it? Yo, I might close it. Yo, 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 fuck the hell off. Oh, okay, I guess they fucked the hell off. We all just took like a fucking grace period. Oh yeah, by the way, this this fucking E-move is fast as shit. 10 out of 10 answer. E. By the way, this, this fucking E-move is fast as shit. This is like normal attack speed, right? Look how fast this E-move is. <laughs> like, bro, what the fuck? <laughs> that move is fast as fuck. But yeah. So, um... I guess any day now, my computer can kind of just be like, damn, that sucks. Though they will, I will say that the dude did suggest one idea, and that's just simply unplug the computer when it's fully charged. That may be the issue, right? Like, maybe it's just been overcharging, and that's been damaging the battery, but he can't say for sure, because the people who fixed it didn't tell him this. He's guessing it off of prior experiences and the experience itself. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to take your word for it. That's why my computer right now is actually unplugged. You are not I used to unplug it a little bit before, not a lot, you know. Kind of just got it there. I don't really feel the need to do this, so I'm not even a plug it. But yeah, I, I guess it's something to keep in the hand Pretty annoying, to be honest. Pretty annoying. Uh, oh my god, like, group the fuck up, please. I have to kill you all, but I need you to be in a group. How can I murder you if you're not group the fuck up? Yo, Dea. Dea. I don't even have your masochism build on. Stop dying. Yo, please. Ah, fucking dickhead. Keep it, like, ignoring the fact that... Uh, this fucking character actually has a shield. She's actually a fucking character. Um, mainly because her shield is just pretty damn good, despite her being invested into damage, not shielding. Her scaling for her shield is actually really fucking good for some reason. Like, I, like most shields just break after like a single couple of hits or interactions, which get her shield is 
needs to be just consistent. Which is really cool. I like that. I like consistent shit. So I'm gonna see if I can run uh, Honkai Star Rail in a second on my computer. I should be able to before I didn't have no space. Now I do. All right, that's garbage. You do a boss. Nah. No, you right on God. Oh right, yeah, by the way, if you're wondering why um, we don't have the chat box anymore, someone tried to dox me, so chat box is no longer there. If they kept it in chat, I wouldn't have to worry about it, but it was on screen, so I had to basically remove the entire thing together, all together. Wait. Did this man always have fucking red booties? What the fuck are these? I thought these were just his bare legs before. What the fuck happened? Why, why does he look like a fucking Christmas elf? I've never noticed that he wore those, but okay. Was that there before? Am I fucking up? No, I, I must be fucking up or something. Yo, Kazu. Burn! <laughs> Oh, he's already dead? Nah, okay, it's between my rotations, but I'm good for one. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough. I mean, he does look like a Christmas, uh, Christmas stuff. You can't tell me he doesn't. I have never seen those on him. At least I've like never really noticed it. But like he does look like one. At least to me he does. Fucking dude looks a little bit odd these days. Also, I've been hearing that Fear and Hunger is one of the hardest fucking games on the market right now for you RPG. That's that's kind of what made me want to play it and has a shit ton of RNG elements, which is what's making it so fucking difficult, which is also where brought me towards it. So, once I figured out how to get the censored version, we about to go fucking crazy. God, this fuck around. Clump up together, clump together! How am I supposed to kill you all in unison if you're not clumped together? Like, look at this dude. He's fucking griefing right now. And, oh shit! Gotcha. Yo, when you got chick, get fuck off me. You're cringe. Yo, fuck off. Yo, fuck off. God damn, Dale, you're fucking long ass burst. Okay, all right, all right. I understand. A look bad. Oh, now they're tired. Lovely. What the fuck? I'm getting my ass kicked by the fucking NPC right now. Alright, I was. Fuck you. Oh wow, that's the first time I've seen that move not crit. Also, um, I've been confused a little bit, alright? But her burst, even without 70 uh uh fucking 70 crit rate, was critting consistently. Like I remember I built her as a cryo. And like a pyro, and she had like fit like 40, 50 crit rate at best, and she was still like landing the crit on her burst like 100 percent of the time. Is that is that is that, is that intended? Was that always intended? Because I felt like there's never been a single time where I haven't seen this character not crit on that burst, except for like just now. By the way, I would like to mention that Kiara is basically fucking like five-star character due to her damage output and her low investment. Her investment is low. All right, well, I see we got screwed up on every single other one of these. 
we got like one good piece. I don't know if I have the money to upgrade it, but we're gonna see. And then I'm gonna see if I can run Honkai Star Rail. And I'll stream until like six, and then I'm going back to sleep. Oh, dog. How you doing? Yay, VP a level increase. Yo, let's go. Let's go. That's crazy. Alright. The fuck? Was, wait, what was I gonna do again? What was I doing again? Oh yeah, upgrade. See if I can upgrade that one piece. Alright, so this character's fine. Let's go to the himbo. Where is he? There he is. Oh, he can't even use the piece because I'm on a completely different set. All right, well, is he damaged shit? What is he running? Oh, that explains it. What the fuck is this? Where the hell is your crit rate, cringe ass dude? I'm gonna build him with EM, so that way 36 of it turns into like an attack. Yeah, what the fuck? Should we build him with all ER? I'm gonna fucking do some funny shit on this man. All right. Let's go to a different Denjo character. Let's go to Kale. He's running this. Right? This is this is not good. This is not bad, but this isn't good. It has EM, crit rate, and crit damage, and HP. The HP is the issue. Alright? Um, and it's only one gilded. So there's not... I don't even know if there's like a fucking... Yeah, there's not even an extra thing for the gilded. Which means I have to replace it anyway. Alright? So we're not going to get rid of this. We're just going to like... See if we can upgrade the other one. And if we do get, because this is better, in my opinion, it needs more energy recharge. It kind of needs more energy recharge. Yeah, um, I, hmm. Yeah, I, I don't think we have enough money for this. I think we're kind of poor. All right. <laughs> uh, I, I know a way to get some money. We got to go do some laundering. I have no I have the perfect fucking plan. Hello lady. So statue. Would you care? No, fuck your tea. <laughs> fuck you and fuck your tea woman. Alright, uh, uh let's see. Yes. Yes, we have Moolah. Alright, get the fuck out of my face. Yo, dog. What are you doing? Man smashing his head against my computer. Stop it. You're hurting yourself. Stop it. Okay. Let's see. Uh, where's Kali? Boom. All right, now my Kali already does decent damage. This is her weapon. This is her, her shit, all right? This doesn't look like the stats of a decent damaging character, now does it? Well, guess what? It doesn't matter. She's C6. Therefore, she's basically a fucking five-star character now. Now, what do you got to say? Cry about it. Right. So, first off, we she needs some improvements, okay? She needs some dire fucking improvements. Like, right now. <laughs> Crazy. I know, right? She does do decent damage, surprisingly. All right, what do you upgrade? Crit rate, crit rate. We love it. To, we love to see it. Love to see it. If I don't get anything. That will be just. That will just be average. But if this, hold on. All right, all right, all right. But that's already pretty damn good. That's already pretty damn good. It's gonna be my first piece back to Genshin. Is this what's gonna bring me back into the rabbit hole of addiction? Constant fucking money spending. Oh, that's not gonna happen. If there's one thing I can say about Genshin, I've never had to spend money to make my character stronger. Like, actually feel them get stronger. Energy recharge is exact. These are all useful stats. So this is actually a perfect piece already. This is actually a piece I want on this character. No idea who the fuck I'm going to use that for unless it's like an off piece. Yeah. This one is for an HP scaler, so that's actually better than you think. This can't even get rid of it. This we might no, I can't even get rid of it. I'll put this on fucking side up. This piece can go. Oh wait, it's fucking. Do I already have an elemental? Yeah, I do. I already have elemental. Uh, 
I already have this piece. I like a better one, which is why this one's here. Huh. Yo, this piece is goaded. This is actually a pretty damn good piece. We're cutting it close, but fuck it. So far, it has went into everything useful. Okay, 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 okay. Though. One more stat, all right? One more. If it fucking goes into HP, I'm gonna be pissed, but I won't be mad, because this is a really damn good piece. But if it goes into HP, this game is garbage. All right, this is a good-ass piece. What the fuck? This is good. We have 34 crit value, all right? And 16 energy recharge. This piece is fucking crazy. This is a good-ass piece. Oh, hell yeah, I'm putting that on Kali. What the fuck? This piece needs to be improved. This shit might need to go. Why the fuck is... What, is, what am I doing with my characters? Why the fuck is Ayaka on fucking deep wood? What the hell am I doing with myself? Why is you on deep wood? Why are so many of my characters that are supposed to be doing... Well, not, not her. Damage dealers are in deep wood. What the fuck am I doing? You're getting rid of this piece, piece of garbage. This package. Uh, no, no, no. No peeking at my customer's stuff. Yeah, shut up. Huh. Well, I guess we used up all of our fucking luck with that last piece. God damn, did we downgrade. We downgraded so hard, I don't even know what the fuck to say. Like, this piece looks exactly like the piece I just sacrificed into it, but it has double crit damage. Oh, sorry, double CC. Or it has uh, CC, there we go. And they're both the same, so I don't know how to feel about it. What did it go into? Because this is like, what, three stat upgrades? And I'm like, uh, no, 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 two stat upgrades and one addition of stat, right? So we added HP to it. The defense got upgraded once. Huh. And I think the crit rate got upgraded once. So it went into like everything once except for like crit damage. Interesting. 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 You know what? Should we go all out? Like just choose another piece? Can we sacrifice another piece like this? Like, oh, like, the scenery like, here is wonderful. This is like garbage. I probably took it off because I had a piece. Job. Yeah, get that, get that the fuck off my account. Huh. Fuck it, I'll take it. I'll take it. That's a garbage piece, but I'll take it. Yeah, see, look look at those perfectly fucking balanced stats. Like, honestly, if you ask me, I think we did a pretty damn good thing here. All right? Our build is goaded, basically. <laughs> what the fuck is she on deep wood? What the fuck am I doing with my character? Oh, yeah, that, that'll work. And then this piece needs to go. God damn it. Fucking goblets aren't EM. They're all like something else. Alright, I might as well just put, fucking put this down. No regrets. I don't, I don't really think it matters. That's fucking crit rate energy recharge and shit. Alright, this is, this is her new build. Her stats. Her stats are still terrible. Okay, shit, but she has 30, 99. <laughs> Bro, the bad part is I really do think she does decent damage due to the way that her C6 works. Or the way that her uh, her Cs work in conjunction with each other. Alright, like let's go into a let's go into like a thing. Is Abyss reset? Yeah, Abyss is reset. Let's go into Abyss. Smack! Also, I would like to say that Honkai Star Rail has significantly more replayability than Genshin Impact. All right, like as a whole. Genshin Impact is the same tedious task of grind, go to Abyss, grind, depending on your level, go to Abyss. But grind, go to whatever level, grind, more grinding, story mission, grind. You get me? It's replayability, but it's replayability that gets tedious and honestly kind of stale. Especially when the Abyss part is... Honestly, this isn't that bad. Compared to last time, this is a significant improvement. But basically, it was just a bunch of fucking mushrooms, some goddamn enemies that were immune to a specific damage type, making it impossible for you to actually use specific characters, and you needed more characters than just one build. 
all right last abyss forced you to be a whale or a dolphin you literally could not do abyss if you were free to play and you were just now getting into the game and you just like got to abyss if you were you could not do it it was not gonna work it was not happening chief cry about it mog shit yourself or whatever the fuck not all right, but we're going to use Kale's little signature team here. So we have Kale, it's Kazuha. We have Kakomi, Kazuha, and then we have, like, one more character. This is, we have Cookie. There we go, Cookie. All right, this is the team I use for Kale, Damage Dealer. Her, e, her EM isn't the main driver. She's just there for a Dendro applicator, essentially, right? That's why I said her stats are actually pretty okay. All right, due to her C6 being her C6 and her using Sacrificial, her dendro application goes through the fucking roof. As long as she has enough energy recharge for her burst. All right. Um, I'm gonna be honest. For this floor, I don't think it matters. For this floor, kind of matters. I don't even think I'll be able to group up these enemies actually. But I'm going for this floor to group. Yeah, these floors are trash. I'm actually. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put this team on the bottom. Actually, fuck that. Yeah, that shit looks like garbage. Still, what the fuck. Yeah, you. What's up with these floors? <laughs> who the hell who the hell are they paying to make Abyss? He needs to be fired. Or at least reevaluated. This shit's terrible. What the fuck are they doing? Alright, yeah. Pff, fuck. Okay. Um shit, I don't know who else to fucking use because these fucking characters are terrible looking. <laughs> these fucking these fucking floors are terrible looking. I don't like them. This looks like a good team to me. <laughs> good team to me. Fuck it. Level 50 Himbo. Cryo, bitch. Oh, hell yeah. I love dying. No energy recharge. Ah, oh, yes. Level 9. Mm, yes. No grouping. Mm, favorite. My favorite part of the of this. No group. These guys are mean. Huh. The only reason I can run this team is because of this character, Layla. That's the only reason. That's the only reason I can run this team. Is like, yo, where are the, all, all the fucking enemies? Yo, get down! How the fuck am I supposed to kill you, Grim Scott? Right, well. I hate these enemies. Like, what the fuck am I? Playing? Uh, Layla is built like a fucking battery, by the way, so, um, she actually generates a shit ton of energy for, like, everybody. So, uh, people neglect this sometimes, they kind of don't think about it, but, um, they're worried about building high crit damage while ignoring the fact of how many times a character has a chance to activate the crit, uh, the crit damage, right, on Pavonius. To me, that has always been a lingering issue. Never understood why people did it, right? And then I was like, hmm, Layla has so many opportunities to fucking activate her goddamn attacks. I might as well utilize that fact and see if I can make something happen. Oh, this team is actually looking five stuff for a second. What? Probably due to just being Layla. There we go. But yeah, so basically, right, Layla's E and her skill. So her E and her burst. They are both on 100% cooldown and downtime, right? They are on 100% uptime, sorry. So you can use them off of cooldown if you have enough energy recharge. Each of them throw out a heat-seeking missile that has a chance to fucking crit. So, that's pretty damn good. Oh, wait, hold on. That's right. Where do you think you're going? You're not, you're not facing the right way, sir. There we go, that's better. So, with that being the case, I was like, hmm, what if I just build her in the way? That kind of utilizes the fact that she, well, has multi -ins. So I built it on a Favonius. She is one of my best cryo batteries that I have ever created. And she does better jobs than fucking uh, Electro. The entire element based around having energy. Yeah, fuck you. A lot of number. Not big number. A lot of numbers. Like, look at how much numbers she got going on there. What the fuck is that? Her normal attack is garbage, but it's mainly this little swirling little pulse thing she got going. That's actually like the damage. You're an arrow, dude. Bro, 
Hold this. Hello there. How you doing? Pleasure to meet you. Uh, get him, Cookie. Fucking lovely, man. He loves one of the best characters I've ever created. If I have a care if I have a team that has no energy, Layla is that teammate that can help. I also focused on different stats than crit rate, crit damage, HP, energy recharge for Layla. I focused on energy recharge and uh, and uh, a little bit only because well, that's all she needs. She doesn't need like a high investment of uh, energy recharge. Her burst is extremely cheap. It's only sixty, so you really do not need energy recharge on Layla. All right, to get her burst rolling. In fact, I think she has like at best like maybe 150, but I, I can't remember because I just haven't built into it and I haven't like felt the need to go into it. I also wish you can kind of check your character stats in Abyss. I don't know why they haven't added that. Yeah. It's a very easy, simple to add to like the briefing. Where the fuck are you going? Yeah. All right. All of these have a chance to fucking generate energy. <laughs> All of this has a chance to generate energy. Wait, these don't count as. Of course, that's cringe. Fuck, I can't see. Oh my god, he's garbage. He's green. Fuck this guy. Fuck you. Yeah, I love this shit. I love Flynn. Did he block that or did that hit him? Dude, what the fuck? I don't think I have anything to take out the shield. He's just blocking everything. And do damage. I fucking hate this dude. Oh my god. This guy sucks. Oh, thank god he's dead. Come here. What's that sound? Come at me. What is he doing up there? Hey, can I use my E to climb up there? I'm curious. Don't die. Fuck, he died. Alright, I'll find out another day. Oh, so why the fuck are there still three of you motherfuckers up in here? What the fuck are you guys doing? Yo, uh, fuck off. I'm taking two damage. <laughs> I'm taking two damage. That's a lot of fucking damage. Oh, shit. Dolly, get their ass. Fuck you. Oh, it's a good thing I'm running a Dendro Electro team, or else this would have been very annoying. Dendro is like one of the best shit breakers for this specific type of shield type. So I have, I'm not gonna have much issue here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get, get the fuck out of there. Fight back! Fight back! Fight back! Fight back! There we go, alright. Alright, let's get the fuck through fucking floor 9. By the way, I'm not gonna do the entirety of this floor. I still wanna see if my Honkai Star Rail works, so. Ah, uh, more mushrooms. What the fuck are these floors? I didn't even manage to get this one. I'm fucking sad. Fuck this game. Ah, you got that. Can't even do damage to this motherfucker because he's in the sky. What the fuck? This game sucks. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck it. I look hairy. All this damage is from my mouth. Got that shit. There you go. See, look at you. Fucking hate this floor. This floor sucks. This is this is just floor nine, and I like. Fuck. These are the anti-Twitter clip floor. This floor is garbage. What the fuck is this? Wait, I'm still thinking. I start off with this. This is good. Get me out of here. I'm gonna leave. 
Please. I beg of your ass. Get me the fuck out of here. Shit's garbage. You are not welcome here. Come on. Go. Come on. Fuck. Hey. You said that's a lot of numbers. I kinda got stuck on him. All right, yeah, I'm out. You gonna check what that one piece is and then I'm going to leave. All right, let me see something. What was that one piece we just got? I'm gonna check. See something real quick. Oh, we actually have four, what the fuck? I'll take it. I will definitely take that. Eh. That's fucking garbage. Okay. Uh, this usually doesn't matter. What? Alright, well, that's cool. Alright, nice! Alright. Shut the fuck up, bruh. Alright, excuse me real quick. As I... Uh, one, move one of my computers. And two, readjust my legs. My thighs are killing me. I've been sitting in the crisscross applesauce position. And to be totally honest with you, it has weighed heavily on my legs. Alright, yeah. You don't need this open anymore. Alright. Come on now, start the game so I can play. No, it's over there. Right. Uh, okay. Yeah, I see you guys into the Shadow Realm. I actually can't do this mission. Give me a second. Not that there's anyone over there, but still. I don't think I am. Yeah, I definitely don't remember being in the Oh, it has to download it. Oh, there's a good thing there's no one fucking here. <laughs> this should be a little bit more out there. I hope that I don't have to work about doing specific things, or else this would be very annoying. Let's go! Yo, bro. I haven't played the game anything on anything else except my fucking weapon, so... Seeing it in actual look-good mode feels very fucking nice right now, I'm not gonna lie. Timing new shit. Ah, uh, yes, very new. <laughs> oh my god, my computer is still having the heating issues. Oh my god.
Right, don't tell me I have to actually turn off my computer like every two hours to fucking play any game. <laughs> Alright. I don't know what I'm gonna do. After I check my shit. Why is my screen like slow? Oh, yeah, no. oh, yeah we're done. Alright. I'm gonna do like one fucking. whatever it's called. The abyss of this game. And then I'm going to shut off my computer before it fucking blows up. I'm not gonna turn on auto mode for any of the parts because, yeah, experiences, am I right? Yes, thank you for telling me something I already know. Points been refreshed? No, they have. What the fuck are you talking about? All right. Uh, look, I'll I'll check all these over time because I already have them checked out. It's just it's just up updating them. All right. Fuck, Nicolia. Ah, shit. Alright. Hmm. Alright. My character isn't built like that, right? So we won't have to make it to where she is built like that. So come to the show. Yes, okay. Attack this. L a level one light gun? The fuck was she running before? <laughs> I, w I was going to transfer her over to like fucking fire, but. I'll oh, switch her anyway. Over to preservation, you go. This out. This out for. Either this or this. This is what I've been using for like the majority of like me building her because I just like it more. Because every time the enemy hits me or when I'm doing my E, the, the top one, it actually does damage, right? Instead of just sitting there doing fuck nothing. This makes it to where I do more damage at first. I think I'm just gonna still do this. Nice. Yeah, but she needs more defense because the fire damage increases off of her. Enhance this. Am I incredibly poor again? Nice. I'm even need some more of these, right? I didn't mean to make 40. But we have 40. Oh, I didn't even make enough. Like, can I not just hold it? Oh, that's great. I hate that. that was just a phone thing. Alright, All right, so. Oh, fuck. Level 70. 1000 defense. 1800 attack. That's really fucking good. Alright, let's see. I believe we can de get debuffed by this enemy and this enemy. And I think she just does a shit ton of damage. I don't think my characters do enough damage for a lot of these things. We're going to find out tomorrow. Um, I'm going to be honest. I kind of want to go with the hunt. If, if this fight lasts too fucking long, we are just going to auto. All right? I'm, pl I'm not planning on autoing, but if this shit takes like a billion fucking years to take out a single enemy, I'm autoing. It's actually pretty good. I have a feeling I will hit this one 99, this one fucking 90, this one percent chance. Okay, feeling I'll hit this one percent chance. I'm so scared of that. Fuck it, we bought. There's no way I actually end up dying, right? There's no way. There's no way, right? There's, there's no fucking shot that I destroy an object and I lose 99% of my health. And even if I did, I, I'm sure I can bounce back. I'm, I'm good. It doesn't matter. Let's press Q. I hope you're prepared. I'm gonna double speed. The, the animations are so smooth now that I'm actually not used to. It. Okay. 
Here, there's thunder. Lance of the ready. All right. <laughs> See, now they both got burnt. No, don't do that. I feel like I'm gonna make a lot of stupid mistakes with uh, the swap. Hey, what can you do? All right, let's see. These are none of the shit I chose. Like, none of these are the path I chose. I chose the hunt. Ah, uh, the more places in my alien, the more damage the time that's useless. There's more chance to freeze. Okay, yeah, these are fucking useless. What the hell's going on? These are equally as useless. But I'll take this one. Let's take energy. Let's see. I'll take this. <laughs> For the sake of survivability. Are there any destructible objects? There is. I just lost all of my fucking HP! <laughs> there is a fucking dude! There's no way! Oh my god! That was the first object! <laughs> That was the first object! There's no fucking shot! You have to be shitting me! <laughs> oh fucking god! Yo, what the fuck? That was the first object I destroyed. We are not even into the fucking game and we have a huge disadvantage. What the fuck did you- <laughs> uh, I'm, so, I'm so mad. I'm with you. Oh my fucking god, you have to be shitting me. Yeah, no shit, last dance. Look at my fucking HP, you goofy ass dudes. What the fuck? I'm so mad. Time to show you. What the fuck? This is garbage. <laughs> what are the chances of that happen? Why? Follow my charge. I'm so bad. Time for the map. Oh, no God. There's no fucking way. Too angry. Oh my god, dude. I didn't even get the bad part is we didn't gain shit from that. We literally just got a negative thing. That was it. Alright? That that was literally it. We just got negative shit. Because we basically just fucking died. Oh, that's good. That's good. Oh my fucking... Man, who the fuck is you? Oh, back to fuck up. I'm with you. I'm so mad. <laughs> I'm so mad. Yeah, fuck you. Also, fuck you. How the fuck did that happen? That shouldn't have happened. What the fuck? Died? Oh my god, dude. It's fucking crazy. Alright, let me see. I'll take that. It's more energy. More energy is always good. You go to a current. There's no way we just get like the unluckiest run I have ever had. I feel like on like on God, there's no way. Alright. Alright, we have trotters. I like trotters. I like more shit. We, I'm never able to kill this guy. So I don't I don't even kill all of my puppets with them. Thousand things. We'll freeze this one. Oh, we can't even freeze. Alright, it's thunder. Lance of the ready. <laughs> Time for the master. Show yeah, master. bro, I'm so mad about that. It's time. <laughs> Lance and he ran away on turn turn. <laughs> Why the fuck did that happen? 
We'll break you. Go. Conclusion. And yeah. This ends here. You. You. I'm on guard. Ah, uh, fuck. It doesn't matter. You're scared. Oh no. Nice. This ends here. Fuck you off here. Dude, I'm mad. <laughs> I'm mad. That made no sense. Why did that happen? Is that even good? Nah, this team doesn't apply damage over time like that. So no, that's not good. So is this good? No, that's freeze on Polia. No, that's not gonna work. This my no, that's also freeze. That won't work. That would be good if there was multiple enemies. What? Just... what? Is that good? Is that supposed to be good? Does random damage types affect anything? I don't think that's very good. I'm just gonna go with this. Fuck. Like having energy. Alright, this is actually pretty good. Crit rate. Love crit rate. Uh, sorry, crit damage. Really. This. Ah. Uh... Shut up, dogs. Why does everything want me to lose my HP? Oh, come on. All right. I guess we're all still fucking dying. I love dying. Dying is my favorite. God fucking damn it. Seize the initiative. How much energy? How much fucking charge do I have on my computer? Not that much. God. I'm with you. Fucking damn it. Yeah. I Everything wants me to not have HP. Nah, I meant to press the fucking. Thousand thanks. There you go. That's bad. Oh my god. Follow my charge. Do this. Thing. Time for. Them. Show no mercy. All right. Kill that. Live the blaze. Man, power. Okay. Uh, yes, I do actually. A thousand thanks. All right, join up. Now we actually have HP again. Let's go. We're not dying. In the name of Landau, Yo. Why is everybody Never fucking falters. fucking dying? What the fuck? What did I do? Here, it's thunder. Lance at the ready. Uh, should I just taunt? Yeah, I don't have any burst. I might as well just taunt. I'll, I'll just apply damage. Over time. Yeah, see, he applies burn to himself when he attacks me. I'd rather have that and the fucking thing load up at the same time. Alright. Get his ass. Hope you're prepared. I'm frozen! This ends here. Hey, fuck you. In the name of Landau, a will forged in ice. Never falters! Alright, alright. Here, this thunder. <laughs> Show no mercy. Alright. My trailblazer is still frozen like a bitch. And she got slowed apparently. I was gonna use her burst before that, but I guess fuck it, we ball. Yeah, we'll Lens the blaze. Alright, now we use our normal 
attack. This ends here. Yo, hurry up and die so I can go to the next battle and then subsequently die myself. Oh. Alright, so that does work. Okay. Yo, kill his ass, slightly more. Fuck him up. There we go. Get his ass. Alright, let's see. Um, after enemy, freeze, doesn't matter. Aftertaste. I don't I don't think this matters either. This doesn't even make sense to me. Is this actually good in any way? Because it's a 1% shield based off of max HP. I don't... Is that good? Is that good for, like, long, drawn-out battles or something? The oh, fuck, I'm not going to read it. it. It sounds like that, so I don't know. Uh, I'll, I'll grab this one, let's see. All right, I, I can deal with that. There's not really much you can do. All right, um, let's see. I don't think I even have any curios. I think my only curio was destroyed immediately, and then I lost all of my HP. <laughs> that was my curio. Lost all of my HP, and it was immediately destroyed. That's all my curio. We might actually take out... Um, one of these characters and put in her. She's really good. All right, one of the strongest characters in the game, if you will. All right, specifically for maybe this, we'll take out Fire Trailblazer if you see this. All right, so yeah, yeah, we'll do that. Right. Anything good? No, not really, but we'll grab this for the sake of my Lord. Right. Mine. See, I don't know why, but when I saw the Trailblazer physical empire, I kind of just went in like this phase where I was like, my Trailblazer needs to be one of my strongest units, but I just refuse to use it. Right? But she needs to be the strongest. I refuse to allow her to not be the strongest. One of them. Right? Mainly because of how simplistic the kit is. Right. Her, her kit is literally, hey, you do bonk one time? Well, guess what? Your burst is when you do bonk harder. That That's literally the entire fucking show. Like, you hit the character, you hit another character harder. There's not much to it. Yeah, that's just basically how I thought it. So I, I kind of just been trying to build her like crazy. It's not exactly working out on her fire form. Her physical form seems pretty good though. Nothing the crazy. But he's... Like unless there's another like uh, thing that comes out that makes burst specifically burst really really strong, right? I don't think she's gonna be crazy right here. Not anytime soon. I will we'll do more snacks. Do that. Hope you're prepared. Follow my charge. Here, this thunder. Lance at the ready. Right, right. Lightning Lord, I'm expecting you to fuck these guys up. Lance the blaze. Lance power. This ends here. Right. Fuck, that's actually pretty decent damage. Considering that she hit like every character in the attack on the Fuck a you. Show no mercy. Dead. <laughs> Time for them. Show no mercy. You the doctor? Alright. I think we the build we got going is mainly lightning lord exclusive. Like lightning lord is going to be hitting. 
I'll take that. That's not very good, we'll reset it. I'll take that. Break effect would be nice, but not needed. For the sake of not taking the damage. Falters. Now this is where the enemies start acting. There's no time to lose. Here, this thunder. It's time. <laughs> time for them. Show no mercy. Strike them down. <laughs> you know what that is? That's. I'm more than this is to regenerate or. Specifically, do when this ends here. Do follow my charm. Conflict is pitiless. That's definitely an increase. It's time. And everybody getting hit gives energy. It normally does before any show. And attacks give more energy. I'm on guard. God damn, look at my burst. What the fuck? Lance ablaze. Lance he gets so much energy. God damn. You got so much energy for that. <laughs> Jeez. Alright, let's see. Uh, we'll grab this. We have quite a few of the hunts. Right? I believe so. Yeah, we have like nine. That's that's pretty decent. Decent amount. No time to lose. I'm just gonna see if I can kill them out there. No. Okay. Fair enough. Here, this thunder. Need a doctor? Yes. Sir. This ends here. It's time. Fine. Did we have an action advantage or did we just outspeed? We probably outspeed. We got them funny little builds going on. I'm not kidding, by the way. We actually have like a funny build going on. It seems like we get like a shit ton of energy. The character freezes. And that would be good, except we only have one dude that freezes the enemy, so. Yeah, and also these are also kind of garbage. So I'll just choose that. It's almost like that's the only good one. It's like the only decent one. We need a strategy. Okay. I'm with you. My strategy is to spam stuff. Actually, we could swap out laser for quantum. Because taunting her doesn't do much. Yeah, we'll do that. But granted, I think I read the book. Okay. Um, let's see. Yeah, she has enough HP for me, and I give a fuck. Ready when you are. Perfect. One. The well matched opponent. I'm surprised. Usually these guys outspeed me. I guess they just didn't for us. Which is cool. Conflict is ridiculous. Show no mercy. I'm 
name of Landau. A will forged in ice. Never falters. A lightning lord. Perfect. Wow, that really just that you that really just gave him point. That's funny. More oh, enemies. Nice. Yeah, well played, I need it. This end here. Bro has slow. She can fucking apply slow. Not you. You're ugly. Goddamn. But Frozo, what the fuck? <laughs> what are all these debuffs? <laughs> Bro, it has slowness, extra quantum weakness, all type resistance down, defense down, another fucking attack down, shock. I don't think that's from her though. Goddamn, more defense down. She has so many debuffs. Like, I, I already had the character before, but I'm still noticing just how strong the character is. That's a lot of damage. But, ow. Yeah, I'll do a, a quick little video. Why not? Dude, it's fucking wild. Oh yeah, Saki, did you see what fucking just happened at the beginning of this run? I said I don't want to lose all my energy. Dude, why the fuck is my computer just letting itself die? What the hell? Computer didn't even fucking warn me or anything. It's a good thing I checked. What percent was this at? Ten? It didn't even tell me. What the hell? He was just sitting there fucking perishing as we speak. But yeah, dude, it's wild. Yeah, um, I was looking at some of the fucking guides and shit and what people were saying about, uh, Silver Wolf. Yeah, I know she applies a lot of debuffs, but the potency of her debuffs Kind of stack really crazy. Was that it? Freeze. All right, that's cringe. We wilding? Oh god. Free? Oh uh, no, they're not freezing. What the fuck? No, don't don't do that. No, don't do that. More enemies. Time for a conclusion. Quantum. Fighting war. In the name of Landau, a will forged in ice never falters. Let me tell your wounds. Let me tell your wounds. Is that quantum? Do I have to weak this here? Nah, it's not, it's not working. Ah, fuck it. I guess I do it anyway. This combat needs optim. <laughs> This is double speed. Follow my charge. I like how Super Wolf's entire thing is, hmm, I like playing games, but I also got bored of games. So I started committing intergalactic war crimes and challenging multiple giant organizations with mass hacking attacks. That is literally Super Wolf's lore. <laughs> just, just, like, that's her current lore. I kind of just really don't like you fuck. So I'm actually going to plan on hacking your major corporation and also making myself one of the most wanted criminals in the world for playing video games. Like bro, come on now. More enemies. Oh, I never even noticed this because I used to play on the fucking I play on my phone. But this will actually swap. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Granted, I still think this, uh, when I was looking at the fucking thing, looks like a dick, so... Yeah. I've got a rage. There's no time to lose. That's great. What do you mean? But, wait, what, what, which part are you referring to? Which one I was talking about? 
I'm going fuzzy brain. Nah, her lord. If you're talking about her lord, that shit is goofy. It's funny, but it's goofy as shit. You gotta admit, that shit is unexpected. Come on now, bro. I expected something like, oh yeah, this dude's a fucking mass criminal that has like caused a shit ton of tragedies or stolen stuff. But nah, her lore is really, hmm, I kind of like video games. <laughs> like, that's, that's her lore. I like video games. Video games are fun. Come on, bro. There's no time to lose. Here, get thunder. Alright, Come on, bro. You can't tell me that shit don't sound at least beautiful. That would be nice on specific things, but once we get to the boss, that's not gonna really matter much. Sadly, I think I might have to just skip this one. This one's really, really nice. Oh yeah, but the critical boost thing is actually pretty nice, so we'll right, take that. I'll grab one of these. Anything good? I'll take it. I'll take it. That's garbage. That's also garbage. We're playing this on fucking, uh, what's your face? On fucking March 7th. <laughs> yeah, I want that. I would actually like this. As I feel like breaking Kokolia will be the most important thing, so I'm, I'm gonna grab this. Lightning Lord's already pretty good at breaking stuff. Lightning Lord is essentially past the level of I don't want you to have a, a fucking strength buff. That's how I view. That's how I view her. Just oh yeah, I kind of don't like you having strength, so let me sap that shit from your punch test. Like that's that's essentially Lightning. Lord. I like how when Lightning Lord was introduced, people kept calling him the bot. Like that, that, was, that was his name, the bot, the robot. What's this? I don't, I don't want to do this. Yeah, never mind. I'm good. There's nothing I can really say is absolutely objective to get in our build. So I, I think I'll take my chances. So, I'm so mad though, dude. All right, let's see. Of course, this entire fucking run. Everything has been wanting me to lose HP, but fuck it, we'll take it. I wish I didn't break that fucking thing over there now. Let's get the garbage. It's also kind of garbage. Wow, these are not good, to be honest with you. I, I guess we'll go for that. That was a waste. Cool. All right, we are now at the boss. You can do one more character. I don't think there's really much character I want to do anyway. To be honest, right now. Yeah, there's not much character. But let's like enhance and shit. There's an action forward thing that I need to prioritize. So what are it? Not that. Oh, that's not. This one. Perfect. All right. That's the only one I want to upgrade. All right, see, look at my face. Ready when you are. Right. I'm with you. E. I command. E. A little something e. Yeah. She fucking resisted. <laughs> I hate this character. Uh, oh, she's faster than my fucking, my fucking dude, my goddamn shield. Yeah, she's faster than my shield. What the fuck? Lightning Lord will break her, so this matter. Before conclusion, action of board. Can I have fun this time? Show no mercy. Fuck you. More enemies. That's good. 
This combat needs Interesting. <laughs> this is double speed. Alright. We have like no damage. Alright, I'm aware of that. We're fine, okay? The name of Landau. Will We're chilling. We don't need that. All right, we need survivability. Oh, I swear. I like how Lightning Lord already has ten sacks again. Like he's just killing on sacks. Hey, look at that! God damn. Yeah, for real. Yeah, we'll do this as well. Oh, you're a bitch. You don't look so good. <laughs> Can I have fun this time? No, fuck you. Uh, yeah. Do this. Go. You are to fail. What the fuck? I just got rid of that. This combat needs optimize. <laughs> this is double speed. Go. Here, the Colia doesn't have a strength bond in this guy. Right? There is no such thing. Alright. Oh. Go again. In the name of Shield going. I'm just gonna wait till this gets taken down normally. I'm not even gonna like worry about taking it down fully. It's not a real threat. I thought it would be. It's not. Like I'll, I'll do this at best. All right. This ends here. That's not very nice. What? What about my fucking genuine? Where's his turn? Okay. Guess you don't get a turn. This combat needs optimized. <laughs> this is double speed. The fuck? So my genuine's turn was up. What happened? Time for a fun. <laughs> Here, this thunder. I didn't mean to do that, but fuck it, we ball. Yeah, our genuine has a lot of turns. I wasn't expecting him to have that many turns. He kind of just did like three turns in a row, didn't he? Oh no! No, fuck you. you. Can't have shit. There's no time to lose. Fucking Lightning Lord already has max stacks and everything. Forged in ice. Never falters. What? That doesn't fucking break. Are you kidding me? That's cringe. It's like literally a pixel. What the fuck? Who's gonna do that? This ends here. Follow my charge. I'm not gonna use any of my bursts until the fucking her health goes all the way down. Like a war. That's like a waste. She has up one HP. Can you like perish now? Is that it? That'd be nice. I think this. There we go. We're not done yet. Are we now? Oh fuck! I forgot it's Ranya. <laughs> Time for them. They're taking out Ranya. Fuck Ranya, bro. Ranya can action advance, from what I understand. I don't have Ranya. Like the one character I don't have is Ranya. Ranya fucking terrifies me. The all the fucking clips I see, Branya is literally the bane of everyone's existence. Legit, everyone's existence is fucking baned by this character. I don't want to find out. More enemies. Oh, fucking Time for a fun. <laughs> oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh no. What the fuck? God damn it. Lady, fuck you. Here, 
Dad. I'm gonna focus on breaking her shit. That way I don't have to worry about dying. You don't get to do that attack. Get out of here. Uh, you bitch. Not them. Good thing I fucking buffered the goddamn shield. Is that all? This combat needs optimizing. <laughs> this is double speed. All right, there we go. Right, uh, I'll do this. Right, now I'll do this. Done. Show no mercy. That's your kind of control ya. Then I will actually implant you. Come on, be your left job. Okay, perfect. Alright. God damn! Stop existing! Fuck. Double fuck. Alright, we're done. You took the bait. Yeah, we're, we're just gonna fuck out of here. Is that it? In the name of Landau. The wheel forged in ice. Never falters. Is that all? God damn it. The eternal breeze will bury me. Interesting. Alright. This combat needs optimum. This is oh, fuck that. We're taking her out. We die. We can't allow you to exist anymore. You don't belong in this world. Fuck you and that attack, bitch. Stupid. I don't even know why you tried. Oh, fuck. Lightning Lord, get her ass. Yeah, fuck you. I like how I use two of these fucking strong ass attacks that I'm mainly using to take out the giant pillar things, and then she summons two after I already used two. Griefing, bro. This character sucks. Dude. <laughs> Oh, it's such a dickhead for that. Show no mercy. That, damn it, that's the only time you've ever said something like that. It made sense. Can I have fun this time? Oh fuck, you don't get to have fun. I'm not having it. Time to show you. I'm doing this mainly because of the fact that I'm going to get hit, so. This is double speed. Fuck you. For In the name of land, a will forged in ice never falters. Yeah, yeah. Uh, now I need to do that. Yes. Oh, I, I can kind of do this. Fuck are you? I'm gonna save this one for the next one. Alright, um, so what should I be worried about now? Actually, um, am I gonna instantly get killed here? Is there something I should worry about? Um, is that all? huh. The world devoured by <laughs> so, uh, what is this? What the fuck is that? That doesn't look good. Time for a fun. <laughs> this combat needs optimizing. <laughs> This combat needs optimized. Uh, lovely for you to join the fucking battle. Useless ass dude. I'm not efficiently using my burst and my perfect at the same time. So what is this thing? And do I need to always have a shield when it's up? Because if it does like no damage, I don't feel the need to have a shield. But if it does damage like crazy, I feel like it's Hope you're prepared. Hi, Freezer. Aww. 
It doesn't seem that bad, but it seems I have a chance to freeze my characters every single turn. We'll just use it. We'll summoning any of them. Yeah, okay, so she's not summoning the giant pillar. Can I have fun this time? Totally fine with that. Uh, Alright, that's fine. I already used Silver Wolf's little skill anyway. Jin Yuan here is about to take some damage. I'm gonna do this just so he doesn't take so much damage. In the name of land will forged in ice. Never falters. Perfect. This will be your very crowd. Oh, she has getting attack increase. Oh shit. This eh, fuck you and this cringe ass attack, bro. Fuck out of here with that garbage. What are you even trying to do? You're not getting that out. See what bitch. The ass girl, the fuck, fuck out of here. Stupid. The foregone conclusion. Dumb ass lady. Uh, so right. He says first. Then he uses. Show no mercy. Here, the thunder. Uh, 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 uh. More enemies. All right, now I'll save that. Yeah, I'll save that as well. Watch me use this thing up there fast. All right, now someone's gonna take them. This again? Have you not learned your lesson, old man? This is not gonna work. This isn't working for you. Stop doing it. You look goofy. You're saying, like, look at you. You don't have a health bar, bro. Where the fuck is your weakness bar at? Cringe ass, dude. Fuck out of here. Get his ass, Lightning Lord. This fuck this dude up. This is double speed. Eh. Boom. No attack. Cringe. Dumbass lady. Stupid. Attack. Old ass Five. bitch. This ends here. Is that all? Ah. Lightning Lord. Show no mercy. Ten stack. Alright. <laughs> Where are my lightning lord? What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? What the fuck? No, I, no, I'm fine with that only because when she when she's about to get her like weakness I've thing got a back. To get to. So, Time for a fun. You know, it's fine. This will be your very There we go. This combat needs <laughs> this is double speed. Good burst up. Cringe. Doing that stupid ass attack that literally won't work. Wait, why is fucking Jin Yuan dying? What the hell happened to him? Actually, what the hell was smacking just now? Perish. I didn't even notice. Man was about to fucking perish. I was supposed to be like, oh yeah, I'm so good at the game. <laughs> Alright, you dead yet? Yep, you're dead. We just won. Let's go. By the way, um, when I was doing this on my phone, I have never gotten this lucky. I I haven't gotten lucky enough to actually yes. beat it. This is my first time beating that. World Six, so let's go. <laughs> I beat World Six on stream. This is fucking amazing. I like how this curio literally almost fucked me over the entire fucking for the like. The beginning of this, I just lost all of my HP. I had 1% HP from this one curio. So we basically started off on the complete negative side and still managed to get lucky enough to not die, which is super fucking good. All right, Ain't anything new? Yeah. All right, by the way, I'm saving up for um, Kafka because Kafka basically is going to be new Jin uh, Gen uh, Yuan. Also, I'm hoping they implement her boss mechanic of domination. If they implement, I'm telling you right now, by the way, if they implement domination as Kafka's mechanic, or because I haven't seen anything about Kafka, so I'm just going on speculation, that shit would be busted as fuck because essentially it means you're able to get like five, five characters on your team, one being the enemy, you get me? And let's say you make the boss enemy 
like, or one of the support enemies from the boss enemy, because, you know, certain, uh, characters, certain bosses have special enemies that they spawn. Go against it, I feel like that would be very busted. Because there are certain, like, uh, spawned enemies that kill the entire team. Like those weird ass robots, that low car robots from the fucking low, uh, low, what is it called? The little area where Clara's from. And then there's the little plant roots things from the deer enemy. Yeah. So let me see what this A launch is. No, oh, I actually almost have all of our A launch. It's crazy. Alright, that's, that's cool. I mean, not wrong. Cuss big or cuss nothing. I mean, fucking not wrong. <laughs> not wrong, that's true. Cuss big or cuss nothing. Alright. Um, I'm gonna be honest, usually I would just, it'll be great, yes. I really hope Kafka's really, really good, and from what I'm seeing, she will be. I'm really hoping, you know, like, it doesn't go from, oh yeah, we speculated her to be, like, fucking crazy, but in reality, she's absolute dog shit, no one get her, right? You get me? Basically, I'm hoping we don't run into a Dea situation from Genshin Impact, where everyone's like, yo, she's crazy. Then like, oh no, she's not, you get me? Oh, so I'm trying to get this. I kind of just want this. I must superimpose it. But, like, hopefully. I have this stuff to superimpose it, I just don't have it. So I'm a little bad about that. Alright, what, what should we do next? I have 80 of these. Just do a fucking boss. What are these? Which one do I need, though? Uh, by the way, on my phone, I'm actually incapable of doing the Kokolia fight. It spawns so much shit that it actually lags out my device to the point where it's, well, unplayable. So I might actually just do her for the sake of doing her because, well, I kind of need, I kind of need the shit. I don't have another opportunity to do it. This is already done. This is whatever that's essentially needed. I'm trying to figure out which character specifically will need her shit. Is this okay? That's actually fucking good. I'm, I'm pretty sure a couple of characters will need it, so I'm not tripping that. What's this life thing? Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna do that. Law thing, yeah, basically. device can't handle that fight that like out of all the fights in the game that is the one fight my device cannot handle it can't do it all right oh okay all right yeah all right good to know one of the strong by the way i don't have the strongest characters in the game so i have one of them and then like the other one i'm just like yeah she's fine all right let's go to cook for you By the way, um, let's talk about the like uh, the current state of the abysses in this game. I'll need you to actually play you. So replace your genuine, replace you. you know what? Is there a point in replacing you? Uh, what are you on? You're... Yeah, but it's like my go-to team for everything. Oh shit! I'm dying. But yeah, so I feel like there's only one singular, um, like, what's it called? Domain? Or are they called domains? Shut up! I feel like there's like one domain that's actually useful right now. That's actually efficient to farm. And it's the one with the normal attack and then healing. And then healing artifact. That's like the only one I find to be efficient. The rest of them are kind of garbage. Also, are, am I going to ignore the fact that this fucking enemy started off with the strongest attack in her arsenal? This is the strongest attack in her arsenal and she started fucking frame one with me. Ah, interesting. Ah, 
Be quiet. Stop barking so much. There's not even anyone out there. Hey! Come here! Come here! What are you barking at, huh, stupid? Yeah, come here! What are you doing? You good girls. You're the good baby. Alright, watch my earphones. Don't snatch them out. I love you too. Alright, get away from me. Alright, get away from me. Bug off. Alright, go kill something. Go do crime. But yeah, um, there's only one domain I find actually worth farming for. And I'm gonna be honest with you. It only. No, this fucking fight is fucking shit. I'm not gonna do this. Yeah, there's only one, and it's the fucking one where it gives you the attack, um, the attack artifacts and the uh, the healing artifacts. One, um, the currency of the game makes it to where you need healers, but there are only two, and you have like one that counts as like a kind of half healer, kind of no, like a 25% healer, 75% shielder, if not 80% uh, shielder, 20% healer. March 7th is kind of like a split, right? Because I feel like March 7th is having a fucking identity crisis with her entire kit. That could just be me. Alright? But she seems like she's supposed to be doing damage. She's supposed to be applying freeze. She's supposed to be doing defense. She's supposed to be tanking. And she's supposed to be healing with her C6 at the same fucking time. So I don't know how one would build March 7th. But I feel like it's all over the damn place. In a sense. Alright? Ice. I know it's not just me. I know it's the fucking characters. Okay? It's I feel like it's odd. Alright? I don't think March 7th is bad. I don't think she's skit. I think she's actually good at what she's supposed to be doing, which is shielding. Alright? But they have split scaled her so fucking much in different areas that I feel like she's kinda lost focus as a character. As a way to build. And this is why most people are confused as to what to put her out. Oh, she's like this, like that. Is this an issue? Is this something I should focus on? Right? And it's mainly because of that thing of he's just all over the place with her fucking kid. Her kid is so split. She has, like, it's the bad part is that the scaling on her split isn't even bad. So no matter how you build her, he will technically be good if you go all in into one area. Alright? That's the part that makes it clear. Because for, like, characters like Jin Yen, right? Jin Yen. Jin Yan has a terrible case of split scaler, okay? Where her defense, all right, for her shield is something to be taken into account of, but her damage for her burst and normal attack is also something to take into account. If you invest into one or the other, you kind of neglect, well, the other one, vice versa, right? And if you invest into both, both will come out just extremely mid. If you're investing into both, it lets you completely perfect the character. Good luck doing that shit. You know, fucking kick my hand. Alright, you know what I mean? So I don't, I don't really see a path. But with fucking, uh, with fucking. Also, Jingan's just kind of mid in control of the fact that she gets 100% crit rate on her uh, burst. Uh, I'm gonna move these dogs to the front. They're doing too bad. Alright, they gotta move. Keep your side. Up their back. Alright.
Did my characters die yet? Oh shit, they're actually not dead. What the fuck? And they're on second phase. They just got back to second phase. Oh yeah, we're fucked, buddy. She froze my fucking shielder. And she acts before him, so... Oh my god, my team! <laughs> Yeah! Look at them! Or, or, yeah, you gotta love the doggos. Two of them aren't mine, but they're becoming mine because my grandma's like, hmm, I just kind of want you to have these dogs. So, you know, I have like three dogs in my bed at a time. The amount of fucking black clothes I can't wear because of him sitting in the bed for a singular fucking microsecond is immeasurable. Crazy. But yeah, so where was I? Yeah, okay. Saturday Night, Night Live. Oh yeah, it is fucking Saturday, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, so March 7th, her split scaling goes quadruple, okay? She either can invest in hit rates because she applies freeze on her burst, which means you have to build it with energy recharge, some attack, right? Or HP and effect rate and a shit ton of it, all right? Or she can go into all defense, where her shield will be extremely good, you can go into healing if you really want to fucking do that, which I have no idea why the fuck you would. And if you do, honestly, I think you're smoking dopamine. All right. And she can go into attack. All right. She can go into attack. She can get an attack. Um, her normal attack, her follow up attack, and her fucking, what's it called? Her first will be all the things that are applied by attack. All right. So there's a bit of things she can go into. It's just, I feel like March 7th will just be all in. Oh my god, why do I keep getting frozen? Dude, this fucking song hits so hard for a battle like this. Dude, this fucking song is good. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. But, okay, I'll explain it for Ghost Start, all right? Ghost Start, what I mean by that is that there's a character in this game that can scale off of four different things, and this means that she can be built off of four different things, right? This means that it's hard to figure out how to build her because she scales off of so much shit that there are many ways to build her, right? You can choose to either invest into all four of them, making all of them mid, some of them making a good portion of them decent, or just one of them making them extremely good. And the weird part is that she doesn't suffer from scaling issues. She suffers from the fact that she's just not a builder. So she'll scale well with every way that you go with it. If you want to build her off of hit rate so she freezes shit constantly, you can do that because she will freeze shit constantly. It's fucking weird. All right, let's see what we got. Garbage. I'll take it. All right, that's fine. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. I like that. I like that. We can't do another one, though, sadly. I don't think so, please. Uh, can I just fight him but not actually get anything? Is that a possibility? Yeah, that's fine. I just want to fight him. I'm bored. I just want to fight this guy. Switch. Destruction! Switch that. Go on to this. I'm gonna enhance this. Yeah. Gives extra crit rate. I love. Also has better scaling than my piece I like. Oh yeah, I saw it inside the server. It looks really good. Alright. Um, if I remember correctly, the way that you're speaking about it, though, it seemed like you had a whole ass team. Do you have a whole team working on that? Because if so, that's impressive. Be good. Alright. Add. I like how my character looks like she doesn't give a shit about anything. That's my favorite part about the fucking travel. But yeah, it looks really fucking good. I can even see it being used in an actual game, by the way. 
which is rare. Usually when people make shit, you can kind of see it being used, just not actually in a production of any type. Your shit looks like it can be used in a production of any type. Related to, well, for now. Where the fuck is it? Where'd it go? Looking at it earlier on my computer, where the fuck did it go? What? Where did it go? I can't find it. Also, I'm in Discord. On a call. Whatever. There we go. Alright, now we can actually start this battle. Yo, does that take out a fucking, a fucking thing? It does, that's crazy. What the fuck? Oh, we don't have any fire. That's fine. We need fire. Hope you're prepared. Yeah. Oh no! My character! You bitch! He's already in prison! Leave him alone! He's just a boy! No crit. Yeah, I really like it. Also, I will have to end stream. I'm kind of going into overtime. Mainly because I just really enjoy streaming. I haven't done it for a little bit. But yeah, I will need sleep and food in a little bit. So, I will have to end stream. Sorry about that. Oh yeah, by the way, there's a chance I can stream at work. It's just really risky if I do. Oh. Huh. That's actually interesting as fuck, Ghostart. What the hell? Oh hell yeah, I'll definitely be a beta tester. You got me fucking in. If my availability is shit, I'm sorry. It's work, you me? But I will try. I will try. Alright. Oh yeah, speaking of work, yo. You guys gotta hear this shit, alright? So, first things first, alright? My boss, alright? Not my boss, my fucking, my supervisor, alright? He's kind of been like, uh, telling me to do weird shit at the job site. In which he tells me to stop doing my duties and to do something random as hell. Right? Now, because if I don't do that, it'll be insubordination, I just do it anyway. Even though it doesn't make any sense to do it. Um, yeah. This man tries to grill me occasionally for not doing my job correctly when he tells me to do these things. And he hasn't taught me where certain things are to do my job. So he'll be like, hey, do your job, but he won't show me how to do the job or where to do it properly. He'll just be like, hey, why isn't it done? Right? Not exactly fair. So, um, you know, we had a meeting today, all right? I had to bring this up. Now, I didn't put him on the spot. Don't ever fucking, like, on the, put someone on the spot, passively mention it, right? And, dude, so another one of his homie supervisors tried to basically be like, no, everyone else is doing their job correctly. Why aren't you not doing your job correctly? Nah, my boss is cool. It's my supervisor. All right, and then he's like, basically, why aren't you doing your job correctly, right? Everyone else is doing it correctly. I'm a ch I just got there a month ago, okay? I wasn't shown how to do it properly, all right? And if they claim that they did show me, there's video evidence of it being true or not being true. And it's not true, so there's no video evidence of it, right? So because this other supervisor, though, basically tried to be like, nah, fuck you, your entire thing that you just said is invalid, right? My boss said, okay. And when's the last time the supervisors have shown anyone around how to do their job? He essentially put every single supervisor on the hot plate because he wanted to be like, nah, fuck you, this is my homie. You don't know what you're talking about. So, now, you know, essentially not only did I make an enemy of my current supervisor, because, yeah, but hey, what can you do? Um, I think one of the supervisors which made everyone else an enemy of himself. Because he put everybody on the fucking spot. Essentially, a lot of people got grilled up. Now, I also had to mention a situation that was going on in the morning. Essentially, yeah, knowing as supervisor. Like, so look, this morning, my supervisor had me running around like a chicken with my head cut off, right? He has sent, so we have to scan stickers, all right, basically. That's my job, to scan funny stickers and ensure, right, that they're all scanned. Now, he only showed me where half of the original stickers were. So those are the ones that I'm able to consistently get. 
He didn't show me where the new ones were. Those are the ones I'm not able to consistently get. He didn't show me, right? I kind of have to find them and hope that I remember them next time I go around, right? And I only do POA on every end of my week, the beginning and the end of my week. So I will forget, right? Especially if it's not a common spot. Now, he tells me, all right, hey, why are you not finding all these stickers? The system got updated, so there are now more stickers, which he also didn't show me. So now I'm underperforming on top of underperforming, right? And I'm like, sir, I don't know where all of these stickers are. You didn't show me where they are, right? And he's like, well, you got this sticker and this sticker. Some of them are like right next to each other. Why don't you have this one? I said, sir, you know that exit lane? The, basically the name that it's, he's telling me I didn't scan? I said, yeah, the one under that is that exact same exit lane because there's only one entrance to the building on that floor and it's the same fucking exit lane that has two different implementations inside the system. Uh, implementation, oh, fuck. And two implements inside the system. There we go, sorry, it works. Right, so basically some of the DTECs don't work. They're in a spot that doesn't have Wi-Fi access, meaning they don't work. They're under the same, they're under different names, but also, you know, only one of them count. And they, and I told him this, and he, as he was giving me the example of, hey, you're not doing good, why are you not doing good? This makes sense, but this doesn't. He pointed out one detect that also didn't make sense. It wasn't set up properly. So I'm sitting here like, dude, what the fuck? You don't even know how to use the system and you're talking shit, basically. I, which is fucking hilarious. Time to show you. I know, right? He told me where half of them are and I still had a good portion of them, all right? By the time I got up there, I had 21 of them out of 46. There was originally 36, they added 10 more. The 10 more, I don't know where the fuck are. He just told me to go find them. But you wanna know the funniest part? At some point during the night, he simply told me, oh, just go walk around and find them. Forget about finding the ones that you usually find. Just go walk around and look for new ones. He essentially told me to abandon doing my original job. That's not good. That is not good at all. He basically told me to abandon my job. Now, because I can't say I'm not doing that, I kind of had to continue doing it anyway, right? Now, this brings us into my last part, all right? So to, to sum it all up, he does not how system work. He cussed me out for basically not doing, for underperforming, even though he didn't show me how to do anything. So he cussed me out for underperforming and didn't teach me, right? So I could we perform. Situation and the last hand. thing is that in the morning, this man told me to take out my personal phone and my work phone and to compare and contrast and to mark down in my personal phone information uh, from my work phone, right? That is not allowed because I'm not paid to do that. That's not allowed to do, that's not allowed, right? Now, I told him I can't do that because there's no information for me to mark on the work phone in the first place. And he's like, what do you mean? It's in your personal phone. Just take it out and recomp compare and contrast. And this leads to a back and forth where I'm telling him I can't do it, right? Now, at the last back and forth part, I'm like, sir, I cannot do that. I'm not a robot and I can't, I don't have photographic memory. And he tells me, yo, watch your tone when you're speaking to me. I'm older than you. I'm like, okay, so about the job, right? I can't do this because I don't give a fuck if he's older than me. And then he storms out, he gets mad and he just walks out quietly. By the way, all of this, all right, I told passively to my boss when it happened. His reaction to me telling the bosses, you know how people usually try to defend themselves? He stayed quiet. He didn't say anything. He didn't say anything to, uh, to defend himself at all. He tried to initially, got cut down immediately, and then when the, su the other supervisor tried to protect him for him, in which the supervisor was also cut off and shut down, he kind of just didn't have much to say. So there's a chance that either he has something that he's trying to keep under wraps until I fuck up, or something that he already has in which I fucked up, which I don't think I fucked up. And if he, even if I did, I worded it in a way where no matter how I fuck up, this man will get in trouble for me fucking up. Okay, until there's evidence of him showing me around and showing me how to do my job, there is now, he can't say anything about me not doing it correctly. And if he puts it on my report that I did it, he gets in trouble. Which has already happened multiple times. All right. So I'm just saying here like, damn. The, fu the funniest part is that the part where he says I'm older than you, 
all right? That when a person says, I'm older than you, watch your tone, right? That and instead of saying in this in his position, I'm your supervisor, watch how you speak to me, it means that he's feeling inferior to the way that I speak. Alright? It means that he's feeling inferior, not that I'm saying anything wrong. Because what I was saying was completely correct. I don't have photographic memory, I'm also not a robot, you know. If I don't remember something, or if I say I can't do it, because it's a mental barrier in which I can't do it, I just can't do it. Nothing you say can change that. Alright, also it seems that my entire office, and yes, this includes my boss as well, doesn't actually know how our system works that they implemented and is forcing us to use. I told them a lot of issues, such as the DTEC's not working, some of them having multiple implements in the system and being in different names but not counting, some of them just straight up not having access to the internet and not working in general, right? Some of them not being there. I recorded videos of some of them not being there, all right? And um, there's also one more issue where the DTEC will actively reset through the night, meaning that if my boss asks me how many DTECs I have and I show him and it reset, I just kind of get fucked over because I did do it, but it, right? And multiple people have been going through this issue, not just me. So, they didn't even know that this was happening. They had no idea. Oh yeah, trust me, there, there's like, there's only, the supervisor is one issue, but no one likes his ass. Literally, no one in the team likes him. I'm not, I'm not kidding, no one likes him. There was a little moment where everybody in the office was naming their supervisors that they liked, right? That actually, like, they feel like do a good job, all right? This man did not have a single person say shit about him. I I know, right? I'm at fucking... Actually, I think I'm at 700 now. Because I got one more follower from my friend just now. It just needs time to update. But yeah, no one named anything they liked about this guy. No one. No one said shit. Alright, which I find hilarious. Right? Like, there was a bunch of fucking people saying, Oh yeah, my supervisor, they show me around, they teach me how to do shit. Right, they're very nice and understanding. My supervisor, no one said shit about him being good at his job. They stayed quiet. So I'm just sitting here like, man, this sucks. Like, dude, how are you so hated for doing something so simple? All you have to do is just not be a dickhead. What's going on? So is it that hard? Oh, I'm going anywhere. This guy just dying. He's just profusely dying. I like how my troubles is still at 100% health. Oh, this guy just is dying. Yeah, it's funny. Dude, stop killing my character, please. Allow her to live. It's fucking alert. Rules are made to be broken. <laughs> Dude. Like, you don't even have to be mad at him. He's already fucked up in so many ways. I don't think there's anything he can do to really come back to him. You know what I mean? Like, basically, all right? When the soup, like, so here's the thing. When the supervisors got shut down for trying to say, hey, yo, you're not doing your job correctly, someone else is, right? Um, the boss responded with, if he doesn't know how to do his job, and you guys haven't shown him how to do his job, and we can check if you did, that doesn't fall on him. That falls on you, and then it falls on me. Because we're supposed to be teaching them how to do their job. These are new people here. If there's new people are not taught how to do it, they're not going to know, right? Because as much as they want to say there's a pamphlet telling you how to do your job, this is a new system that was implemented this month, all right? And the stickers are one inch by one inch stickers, all right? In a white interior building, and the stickers themselves are white. So you will not be able to like find them. Also, we are walking around at night. So, we're not going to be able to find them if no one shows us. Alright, and me, I have, I'm actually blind, okay? I cannot see well. So, when I'm looking for a one inch by one inch sticker in a fully white building, right? I'm not going to be able to see it. I told him this. He did not care. Alright? Like, I'm, like, he's fully aware of this. I can't tell you his name. That's, that's revealing personal information. Can't do that. I never do that. Okay. But yeah. Um, other than that, I have a co-worker who's mad at me and has been holding a grudge for the last three weeks because I asked my supervisor, what do I do if somebody's late? He heard me ask this question, right? Meaning I asked the question in front of her. I have no idea why she would assume it's about her. If it was about her, I would not ask it in front of her. I would ask it personally. And uh, she took it personally. 
ever since then she's been kind of treating me different right i didn't really acknowledge it too much because it didn't affect much until she started showing me attitude and then it started affecting me all right yeah um it turns out that um to be totally honest she's just petty but i think it might also be the addition of uh a, for a family matter situation that happened recently so th there's a chance that something happened out of her home which i know about i'm not telling you this personal information but... you put her in there come here but yeah so Ugh. Wait, she eats it? Oh, I already fed it to her. <laughs> it's funny with my grandma. But yeah, so yeah, um, the the re most recent coworker. By the way, I had a little scuffle with her at work, meaning I talked with her. The, oh wait, that applies to my father. I talked to her, right? I asked her, hey, what's going on? What's the issue? And her words specifically, when I asked my supervisor, what do I do if a person's late, right? Because I would have just walked out, basically. Um, she said, I showed her how I really am that day. Me and this woman interact for two minutes, literally two minutes, and then she goes home or I go home. So I'm sitting here like, what the fuck are you talking about? I don't know you well enough for you to know how I really am. No, no, no. No, I put him in the front. What? Ran back. Oh, ran back out. Come here. I didn't but yeah, so I'm like, bruh, there's no Maggie, way. Maggie, back here. Go and tell you, Grandma. I have no idea. I'm surprised we don't have an infection already. <laughs> he just like, ran back so fast. So I'm just gonna order food. You pick it up, they'll do it. But yeah, so that that's what's going on with my coworker. Essentially, she got mad, kept a grudge for no reason, and then kind of just kept like fucking acting a different way. No idea why the fuck someone thought that was appropriate. But the thing is, there's a reason why I ignored it for three weeks. One, it's because I wanted to make sure, absolutely sure, if you dox, if I dox your supervisor, that'd be funny, but I don't think it'll do much to him. It's like a 40-year-old man. It don't matter to him. But yeah, so look, the thing about this fucking co-worker is like, I only, the reason why I waited three weeks is to make absolutely the fuck sure that this woman is angry at me for a specific reason, all right? I needed to make sure. I couldn't just be like, oh, no, she's mad at me. No, she was, she was not happy. She, was, she did not like me. He's <laughs> destroying this man's neck, grandma. <laughs> so yeah, I was like, all right, there. By the way, um, I'll be up roughly a couple of more minutes and I'm going to hop off. I could choose to just stay up. You know, guys, I could just choose to stay up and be sleep deprived at work, but I don't know if that's a good idea. Hmm. What no, granted, I did sleep for like five to six hours. Uh, already. Something is, do you want to leave? What are you talking about? But I'm ordering food, guys. Alrighty. Uh, let me see when the food will be here. So I can tell my brother. Hmm. Life is as. Uh, some... uh sure. Food will be at 6.45. And fuck you. 
There's another one right here. What the fuck? I didn't notice these. Is there another one somewhere? There has to be, right? Yeah, there's one over there. What the hold up? I didn't even notice. <laughs> I have to go find him. No. You're not getting shit, little bro. You're just gonna have to stay hungry. I'm sorry. Oh, that's interesting. What the fuck? Look inside of the effect. By the way, this is impact frames being abused, by the way. This man throws a very slow punch, in my opinion. <laughs> the impact frames make it look so much better. Alright. Found the Mac accidentally, but the ball. I don't think there's really anything I want from this right now. I'm gonna be honest, other than like the gems, I suppose, but they're not really something I consider important. I already got the super in position of this thing, so I really don't care. And all of this is stuff I can grind for, so. Like, yeah. Like, after you get these two, it's like, whatever. Like, the entire event is void. I got, yeah, I'm doing Silver Wolf shit. The thing is, I already got what I needed for Silver Wolf, so. So, for Silver Wolf, right? For her event, you get one gems, and you get, of course, if you have a Silver Wolf herself, you get her off the wish thing, but for the event itself, you get this one. This is her four-star signature light code, all right? For some people, this is basically better than, like, every other light cone in the game for, the, her, for like, anything. Yeah, she hackered. It does fucking crazy. She's the newest five-star character, all right? This is her signature light code, all right? For the event, you can get the super impositions. A super imposition is basically just getting uh, the copy of the light cone to enhance it, right? In which I got all of them. So I just enhanced it to max. So, yeah. Um, good light cone. It's actually really, really good. Yeah. The event itself, I'm gonna be honest, I don't like running around. Running around vent events annoying me. They're not bad, per se, they're just annoying. Ugh. All right. But yeah, so it keep happening. But I think I might have to end stream now. There's nothing else going on. All right, we played some games. We, get, we warmed it back up and to the idea of streaming. Um, I feel like my computer's going to burn anyway, by the way. It's still hot as shit, so I might actually bring it in as a concern thing. All right. I do want to build some characters. Damn, look how small the characters are. Look how small. Look how small this fucking character is. Look at shit. Look how small the character is. It's fucking tiny. So yeah. What's up, Ghost Art? Oh, so she needs crit rate. What the fuck? Now that's why she has not crit rate. Why does she have crit rate? What the fuck am I doing? Whatever. Whatever. Oh, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. What should you add to the FNAF game? What's your what's your current limitations? Because you can't ask a question like that and expect me to say something. something. All right, if I tell you to add fucking SpongeBob SquarePants, you're gonna look at me different. Unless you're talking about specifically a mechanic. Like, what, what are you asking me in specific? What should you add? A character, a mechanic, an item, an area, what?
Thanks, not bad. Lore accurate games. So, a lore accurate game to the original Five Nights at Freddy's? Alright. I say you add lol bit, but give them some actual significance other than just being a recolor of uh, fun time uh, box. All right. If you're not working on sister location, lore accurate. I say you add that one fucking dog animatronic that was rumored to actually be real. All right. From like 2000, like fucking 15 or 13. All right. I would think that'd be funny. After the bite, a year after the bite. So like what? After fucking, after the original establishment of Five Nights at Freddy's Three. Sorry, not Five Nights at Freddy's Three. Five Nights at Freddy's Four. The fucking uh, the one where you're at the house. Yeah, fetch. There we go. So the one that happens like a year after the bite is like Five Nights at Freddy's Four, right? With the fucking sister location. Sister location. No, not sister location. What the fuck am I talking about? The one at the house. There we go. Which one is that? I forgot the name of that one. The bite of baby. Oh, yeah, then yeah, the fucking house. All right, the one where you're running around as a little kid in your room. Yeah, that one. If it's a year after that, then uh, then yeah, adding fetch won't make any sense. Oh, I know. Add the mimic. Want to spar? As a secret, because the mimic is apparently. Um, oh, actually, would that make sense to add in this one? Yeah, add the Mimic. Because apparently the Mimic has been a long time standing animatronic, but has never been implemented at all in huh? any significant manner whatsoever. <laughs> Go. Want to spot? Oh, yeah, the fucking nightmare animatronics. You're right. They are nightmare animatronics. Is there really much more lore significance to, to the fucking Five Nights at Freddy's 4 other than just the bite of 83? Because to my knowledge, there isn't. Huh? There isn't that much fucking lore significance. <laughs> other than just, hey, yo, this happened in 83. Yeah, he, he, yeah, the Mimic is one of the first animatronics. But that's why I say the bite of 83 would be like, it makes sense, but. There's no more, I don't think there's a lot you can fucking add to that unless you're trying to fill in like blanks or add new shit to the already God. existing lore. You get me? Also, I need to know your limitations because if I'm like, hey, yo, add this funny mechanic that will hint at this, then you're gonna be like, huh, interesting. Yeah, that's what I thought. There isn't a lot of lore in FNAF 4. It's kind of just, hmm, this kid has schizophrenia and you have to help him not get schizophrenia attacks. That's basically Five Nights at Freddy's 4. This kid has schizophrenia Help him not get schizophrenia attacks. Wanna spar? <laughs> Peace. Peace is above all things. Shut up, you're cringe. What even is peace? <laughs> yeah, that, there is none. Oh no, of course not. All right, so the issue with fucking Five Nights at Freddy's 4 is that there is a mechanic. There are multiple mechan mechanics, right? But ultimately, me the mechanics for the animatronics still follow the same general rule set of Five Nights at Freddy's 1, where Chica goes down one line, Bonnie goes down one line, Freddy does his own fucking thing where he just spawns in your goddamn room, which is the Freddles, and then Foxy will rush from one area to the next area and then end up somewhere else. All right, that's essentially the premise. All right, fun time Foxy will go from the edge of the hallway or the back of the hallway to your fucking room in your closet. 
And then from there, he becomes a totally different mechanic, all right? Chica, Bonnie, same fucking thing, different sides. Freddy, spawns him back and you just check him a couple of times, all right? Personally, okay, I'd like a fucking mechanic, all right, where there is an audio cue that you have to listen for, okay? Because the, the entire game is based off of audio cues or a visual cue on one of the things in the background that you're looking at, so the room itself, where, hey, yo, if this lights up or if this symbol shows, go check this and implement this. You get me? So like, let's say, cause you know, like let's say we're making hints towards a uh, nightmare being in the game or Golden Freddy being in the game, right? Mm -hmm. Since we want to add more lore to it anyway. Nice. Make it to where you're able to interact with like, I don't know, the fucking wall or some shit when a specific item pops up on it. And then you have to go up and either click it or fucking stop it from doing whatever. All right. And make it happen like randomly, literally just RNG mechanic. All right. Like it can happen during night one, just out of nowhere. And if you don't know, you just fucking die. All right. I'm tired of night one on Five Nights at Freddy's games being, hey, yo, let me teach you about the game. No, fuck that. You won't learn about the game. All right. The hard way by dying. You can still walk around in there and still cams and doors. There are no cameras in Five Nights at Freddy's 4. You're inside of a room. What are you talking about? There are doors, but you have to walk up to each door, so that's different. Oh, you're talking about Five Nights at Freddy's 1. There we go. Sorry. Yeah, there are cams and doors, but I'm talking about the layout of the care of the animatronics, not the fucking uh, the layout of the actual office. That's different, all right? Yeah, I feel like there are a lot of like uh, audio cues, but no visual cues for a lot of the animatronics. Like for instance, in Five Nights at Freddy's One, when Freddy enters your room, he will laugh. When someone's at the door, there'll be an audio cue for it. When Fox is running down the hallway, there'll be an audio cue for it, right? There'll be visual cues on the cameras, but the cameras are, well, the fucking cameras, right? In Five Nights at Freddy's 2, it's the same fucking thing. Are they monitoring the cameras? There are a ton of audio cues from when the animatronics are in the vent, when the fucking uh, when one of uh, when the animatronic is like above your fucking office, inside the hallway. They use the same exact audio cue, by the way. It seems that none of them are different. There's very few variations, but they're audio cues nonetheless. In Five Nights at Freddy's 3, I think there's a lot of there are no fucking audio cues. There's just huh. It seems that you got just you just got screamed at by an animatronic. That is your audio cue to fix things. All right, and then things fuck up. Then yeah, yeah, do some visual cues because there needs to be like fucking. Like, cause the kid obviously has schizophrenia, so you might as well already add some shit that hints towards <laughs> mental disability in some way. In this case, I say you make hints towards the bite of eighty-three by making it to where, um, what's his face? Golden Freddy or whatever the fuck he did, sorry. But what, what, what was his face? Yeah, just make it to where Golden Freddy has hints that he exists throughout the night. Because I feel like that's something that's very lacking considering that he's the game's fucking antagonist, right, at the very end of it, or Nightmare. You know I mean? Like he's the like bit of lore, the most important piece of lore is that, <laughs> hey, yo, this kid got his fucking frontal cortex bit the fuck off at this date. But there are no other hints to Golden Freddy doing this at all. That will also work. Granted, it will be terrifying as shit, which is nice. You know what would really be funny, though? <laughs> if for one of the fucking jump scares, all right, like let's say uh, Bonnie or Golden Freddy make it to your office... Just make it to where when you're trying to check the back of uh, the uh, the back of you where the feathers are or where they spawn, it's just fucking Golden Freddy standing above you, and instead of you turning around sideways, you just look up and you just see Golden Freddy, and then it just fades to dark. There is no jump scare. All right, that shit would be fucking hilarious. Like he's right behind me. He looks up. Golden Freddy's just staring down at you, about to murder you. All right, I need to turn off my computer. All right. This thing's been on for too long. It's overheating and shit. Do you like food here? Oh. 
Now it's 6.50. I oh, love it. Love it. All right. Time for me to end stream. It was a pleasure playing with you, Fox. I'll see you guys around.